Right. Get a dragon. Can I get another hat? Oh, didn't you, didn't you buy your gray hat here? No. I had to get a gray hat offline. Keeps cutting out over there. My apologies. I've had to restart the stream three times. I'm so sorry. There's just an excessive amount of people here tonight. See Springs brand mineral water. You see all the little touches of old Springs, Florida all over the place. You'll find them like on walls, sides of the building. Sorry guys, if you're just coming back, I apologize. It keeps cutting out I, over there by the band. So we're gonna get out of the way and move out of these dead zones. <laughs> um, yep. A lot of construction going on. This is going to be Terralina eventually. So we're just trying to move on onward and upward here. So if it's been many years since you've been at Disney Springs, oh wow, there's live entertainment everywhere. Different restaurant locations have different live entertainment. Yeah, they're expensive. You're right. Yeah, so we have any 90s baby dolls out there? Woo! What we're gonna do is take some old school classic Disney films and put it together with some 90s music and kind of smush them together and make something right here on the spot in front of all of you guys. Oh, 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 <laughs> Just in front of Paddlefish. And I've never seen that many people there. And as long as it's 90s, as long as it's Disney, I think it should be good. So, Mr. Jane, can you start us off on something? Paddlefish used to be the Empress Lily. And then after that, it was Fulton's Crab House. So, Paddlefish has been many, many things, it's been through many, many remodels. So it's a very, you know, pricey kind of seafood restaurant, very like San Francisco prices. Here's another view of the, str the springs. So it goes all the way through and down by Planet Hollywood. And it kind of give you, gives you that illusion like we do at like Wilderness Lodge as well as... Um, I know, it's pretty So it looks like... It, the springs goes all the way through into the lake because now this is the main lake which is real florida lake water but actually it doesn't <laughs> go through but it gives you that illusion by using the bridge t-rex still here i think i think they'll be here until little kids don't insist to go eat there to mom and dad it's very popular with the little ones i get it a meteor shower is kind of fun same same kind of atmosphere as rainforest you know they've been around since the beginning of time but definitely you're there for the ambiance not the food <laughs> oh yes yeah, Sosa's that's it welcome back yep perfect yeah there's a couple of dead zones is it better now all right perfect perfect good just let me know if you're, if you can't see me or hear me let me know there were just little pockets of bad areas over there by the water. <laughs> okay. Oh, oh, you made it to Disney. That is awesome, Shelly. Yes. Well, I'm, Mag I'm at Magic Kingdom on Monday for sure. I'm there. So this is a brand new bridge. Another place that Rob loves and we love to Big Bad Wolves. BB Wolf Sausage Company, little quick service location. You can use your snack credits. Wonderful. And they make these three little pigs sausage combo. It's just a little sample 
little Hawaiian buns full of sausage and they're amazing. Very good. So good. So, you know, we just go get some batteries. Oh look, it's another Lego store. Lego. <laughs> More Legos. Oh no, Legos again. Yeah. <laughs> no, because we can never have too many Legos in our life. <laughs> and these are Disney Legos, so they're better. <laughs> of course they are. Oh, no, it's inside the co-op, remember? There's our dragon. It's a different dragon. Dragon. No, it's not Elliot. It's Dragon. 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 But it's Dragon. <laughs> He's been here since the 90s. Since when Disney Springs, Downtown Disney, Pleasure Island came to being. He's been here since the 90s and the late 80s. Yeah. All right. Yeah, we're gonna get some batteries before we die over here because fuel rods need a changing. So thank goodness we're back on Disney property, so I, I don't have a coronary. We do have fuel rod locations here at Disney Springs as well, multiple. World of Disney is running, a, it's run under construction. So basically it only goes to about where Starbucks is. All of this is closed right now. So you cannot, like more than half of the store is under construction. So it's a really tiny, tiny world of Disney right now. Really tiny. Oh, we've got a list of the performing arts performances here this weekend. We got some high school, oh, concert band. Orchestra and concert band this weekend. That's cool. Sometimes it's dance groups, it's all different. get a free chocolate from Ghirardelli. You can always get a free piece of chocolate at Ghirardelli. They do. They always give you a free piece of chocolate. So, FYI. Anywhere you can get free Disney food is good. <laughs> There's uh, Mr. Stitch. Watch out. He spits. But I don't know if he's spitting tonight. Let's hope not. And there's a basin store too. Oh, Disney Lush. That's what it is. Disney Lush. They have the bath bombs and the soaps. All of that good stuff. Lotions, amazing. Oh, I was gonna show you where you can get the Disney soft serve here. They do sell like the root beer floats and everything, but they ran a soft serve last time we were here. We did the void, that's the last time we were here. <laughs> it's like, how do you run out of soft serve? I mean, really? <laughs> yep, we're going to the Marketplace Photo Pass location. Margaritas, the dockside margaritas, always awesome, but it's right here. This is the soft serve stand. Mm. This is the soft serve place, honey. See? Yes. Like I always tell you guys, there's a super secret soft serve location here. Uh, yeah. <laughs> we got soft serve ice cream, pineapple, vanilla, or soft serve. You basically can get a Dole Whip and a Dole Float too. There you go. This is the place to get a Dole Whip or a Dole Float at Disney Springs. Mm -hmm. And you don't have to wait an hour at Aloha Isle. I say go to Pineapple and I at the Polynesian this way because it's around the corner. I'll show you where they hid the, the fuel rod vending machine because they had moved it on us. It used to be in this corner. Oh, they moved it back. You see, they moved it back. <laughs> it's bad when you know where all of them are located, but it is necessary. Broken. You Maybe it's just making a sound. Nope. It's not working. Oh, there it goes. There wait, it goes. Wait, there it, goes. Wait, wait, it made a sound. That's it. It's got it. You gotta wait for that sound. Bam! Two more to go. And you can do photo pass right here. They have all the cool digital backgrounds. So use that memory maker to your advantage. Pop Century has one. It's in the bin, it's in the, um, it's in the arcade. Pop and Art have it both in the arcade. Yeah, it has, Judy. You're right, you're right. Yeah, definitely 
would like to meet you guys. Yeah, we're just hanging out. Yeah, we're not doing this shopping show, Cindy. We're putting it off right now till we get all the details hammered out. So, Legos. Yeah. So I know some of them are just joining us. Uh, joining us from like they haven't jumped on all day. Yep, we're just switching them all out. But Fuel Rod, we love you. You didn't do that last time. But the sound? Oh, there, oh, there it goes. Yeah, it just takes a minute. So, yep, perfect. Put it in. You made that sound. It's time. Yeah. It, you gotta wait for that beep, 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 and then it's ready. I think that one is, does it make that beep sound. Oh my god, no. She's broken. All right. And then this connects to the co op, one of our favorite shops here, because it's a kind of an amalgam of all the different stores cute little, cute little unique stores. We have the 28 and me. They have really cool guy stuff here for the men's in your life. Fantasy Land is my home. Ooh, more, more Hawaiian shirts. Busy getting dizzy. Dinner shirts. Uh -huh. Rowan and Crown. Oh look, they have my shirt. Is that embarrassing that I'm wearing that shirt right now? <laughs> Ooh, look, they have a big Thunder Mountain one. Nice, that's beautiful. I kind of like that one, that's pretty. You see this one, Bunny? Oh, look at the Pirates one. Castillo de Moro. Ooh. Why do they have to come out with all the cute shirts? That's nice. I don't even see it. Are they sold out? Oh, that's the back. Right there. Oh, this is the... Really? No, oh, it's black. No. Lies. I've been hornswoggled. Oh, that's LeFou's Brew. Yeah, oh, it's LeFou's Brew. Okay. You got in a guest on staff and it says on the bottom, nice. But that's the Pirates one. That's cool. Castilla de Mortis, but it says right on the front of the Pirates. Oh, the Caribbean. Ah, it's right here. There's one left in a small, naturally. Plundering the Caribbean since when? Castilla de Moro, Armory Supplies. MVCXLIII. So that is... Pirates of the Caribbean. Yeah, oh, I know. I was like, oh, so of course there's only... What's the Roman numeral here? That's what we were trying to figure out. Here, can I turn it around? Give me a second. You should be really good at that. It's 1,000 something. Yeah, it's 1,000. C is 100 minus 50. 53? Something 53. 19? No, it has to be 1853? Hmm. I don't know. Can anybody tell me what that is? What the Roman numerals mean? What year is that? M D C X L I I. So that's 53. X is 10. C is 100. D is 50. M is 1,000. But I know so the way you have to subtract them. 1553. 1553. Thank you. All right. Thanks, Rob. Thank you, baby. I'm like, I can't do the math, but I know what the letters stand for. I got it. Uh -huh. A so popular one shirt, one, right? I yeah, can tell. Last, one. last shirt. We got it. Oh, which I got a small left. You got oh, Skull Rock. Rock. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, that's your shirt. Oh, no, that's different. That's <gasps> the new redhead shirt. Oh. We had the, it was the gold gray one that took me off the redhead. It's like the new one. Oh, you need it. You need it in your life. You need it. That's nice. They got a redhead shirt. That's beautiful. Yeah, all the 28 main shirts are amazing. They're very soft. Yeah, they're very soft and just nice. <laughs> I know. Too bad we don't have Christmas discount anymore. You got a Jacques Lindsay's hanger bar one, turkey leg, and the proverbial Disney dad shirt. Everybody wears the Peter Pan shirt. <laughs> it's popular because it's so cute. My favorite store, oh, is Trendy. It's the very, out of here at the co-op, the Trendy will be my favorite store. Centerpiece, which will float into the 
will float into the Cherry Tree Lane dress shop. This is all your Disney house stuff. All your Housewares. beer guest housewares and Housewares plates. Decor. Housewares and decor. We've got Mickey Mouse kitchen stuff. I do like the Ariel place. If they just had a whole set, they also had dinner plates, but it's all like little bowls and app plates and we have full service dinner plates. Because it'd be nice to get a whole set. But Ariel, Little Mermaid stuff, tea sets, mugs, and then you got bathroom stuff right here too. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, wow, that's awesome, Judy. Oh, there you go, Christine. That is so cute. Yes, I got your tag. Thanks, Corey. I'll have to go through my page at the end of the day. I can't really flip to my page right now. Little Dumbo purse. Oh, and the skirt. Mary Blair stuff. Oh, she did come out live. She comes out with clothes. And I'm sure you already know Mary Blair was the Imagineer that designed Small World, so she's amazing. We got some kitty cats, kitty cats dress. This is Cherry Tree Lane, by the way. Oh, then now they have cover ups that are Disney cover ups. Wow, that's cute. This is the dress shop at Cherry Tree Lane. So if you want a Disney bound or have Dapper Day every day of the year, you could come here. Oh, is that the Dormouse? Oh, yes. Alice in Wonderland. Teacup skirts. We've got the Monsters, Inc. dress. The co-op is uh, in Disney Springs. It is right next to um, Arebus Brothers. I'll show you the outside once we go outside so you know where it is. It's just right next to World of Disney. Just keep going further. Um, like you're headed towards Once Upon a Toy. Once Upon a Toy. So keep going. Yep. Mary Poppins. I know, I know. Yeah, this is inside Disney Springs. Just keep going. You've got Daisy. you got your tightrope walking girl from... Um, which I got for Christmas, so I do own her. Um, they have more Mary Poppins dresses here, Orange Bird, got a Snow White, and they put all the accessories right next to the dresses. So you have, I love the Enchanted Tiki 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 Room dress. They have all the different accessories to go with it too. Is that like a Polynesian one? Like yeah, like Trader. Yeah, like a Trader Sam's kind of dress. That is awesome. See, then your honey can get the Trader Sam's Hawaiian shirt, and you're golden. You're like all together coordinated. Yeah, definitely. Yep. Just look for the co-op. The co-op. This is like the best store in here because honestly, they have the coolest stuff in here. They got Tower of Terror. Yeah, it's all very expensive, not cheap at all. A lot of the dresses are 98 all the way to $198 and up. So, you got a Tower of Terror section here. You got your Daisy Haunted Mansion section. Oh, the other Haunted Mansion dress. Oh, it's right over here. I was going to say it's gone, but they also sell the crinoline underneath to wear. But you can always get that online, too. You got your Dooney and Burks to match it. And you got your Disney World Parks dress. You have Space Mountain, the castle. And we have here Enchanted Tiki Room, Pirates of the Caribbean. So you get your little Magic Kingdom themed dress as well. But this is called the Dress Shop at Cherry Tree Lane. And then you have your Alice in Wonderland stuff right here. And you also have like bridal stuff, bridal ears. There you go. They redesigned the bridal ears, so they're really, really much cooler now. These are these are a new design. These just came out recently. And these are oh how much? I didn't even price these out. Lime. I don't know what how much lime is. They don't have the, the legend. But most ears are $24.99. That's probably a little bit more, I would say. Yeah, I'll look over here. Crossing over into the Wonderground Gallery. This has a lot of um, Jasmine Beckett Griffith's artwork, which is uh, she does all the big eyed stuff, so that's really, really cool. 
This is Brittany Lee's artwork. Looks like all the different countries, a small world. That's really, really cute too. Oh yeah. So pretty. Is there a new one? Oh, the happiest cruise that ever sailed. <laughs> They have a Tumblr. This is Jared Maruyama's artwork. So they have several artists that they feature here. Very cute. Oh, it's very like kawaii. I mean, he is Japanese. You got Dreamfinder. I love this Epcot one. How much is this Epcot? Oh, $2.95. That is not bad. You got the Dreamfinder original figment. I love that. Three Caballeros. This is like old oh, Ratatouille. Oh, they're already prepping for Rami. Food Rocks. Ah, oh, yeah. Kitchen Cabaret. That is awesome. Hipster Mickey and Minnie. Hipster Mickey and other really popular. Dumbo Air, Pirates of the... I like these old ones. They have we got some figurines. Haunted Mansion. Nice. Oh, it's with uh, it's without a frame. It's it's on canvas. It's a canvas. Yeah, it's without a frame. That's nice. I don't like the color. Yeah, that's expensive. <laughs> We've got these awesome portraits over here too. We've got the Red Queen, Maleficent, and Cruella. So we've got a lot of really cute. Yep, I hear that girl. I knew I knew you'd like it. For sure, for sure. But I love the t-shirt too. Of, um, of Ooh, that's pretty. Wow, these are nice. We've got Belle in the library with Chip and Mrs. Potts. This is Yoon Joon Joon Kim. It's another artist. the green clover and aloe which is the beach club candle you can make the beach club candle here they have different scents now mm. oh no green clover and aloe i know they had it right here the green clover and aloe smell that That's the smell of the beach club lobby, Yachtin Beach. All right, I love that smell. Oh, that's it, right, the green clover and aloe. I want to smell it. <laughs> yep, that's it. That's the smell of the Yachtin Beach. I know that smell very well. It is so good, so good. So if you wanted the green clover and aloe and you love the way the Yachtin Beach Club smell, just come here and buy that. <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, these are wax melts. These are wax melts. Oh, yeah. Sorry. <laughs> oh, and they've got oils, too. We're all about... Oh, and they have a green clover and aloe oil for an aromatherapy diffuser. That's cool. I would get one of those. <laughs> oh, monkey foot. I don't think that's what monkey farts smell like. No, it smells good. It kind of smells like a little Polynesian y just because it's banana y. Banana y and like citrus. Banana y. Banana y. Oh, there's more on this side, baby. Bananas. I'm just trying to see if they have more like hotel smells, you know? Like Polynesian. I need me a Pirates of the Caribbean candle, like Rome is Burning candle. Maybe vanilla sandalwood. They have so many different flavors. It's amazing. Oh, under the sea. Let's see what this one smells like. Do you want to get all four in that way or you want to get all eight of them that way? Mm, that smells good, under the sea. Get all eight here? Made in Florida. They're local. Nice. They draw a lot of fun. Oh, got it. Good to know. Good to know. No, oh, that is, it sees the moment. It smells familiar, I don't know, rugged patchouli. Is it too patchouli-ish? I love patchouli. Oh no, that smells like a lobby, I don't know where. Is it Grand Floridian? Hang on, this smells like something. Dirty hippie. What's that? Patchouli. Oh, straight patchouli, but rugged patchouli, this... This smells like somewhere. I can't place it. You guys are going to have to it smell like it. Too. Oh, yeah. Uh, I'm going to have to research all these smells, you guys, because these smell like... That one's Florida Orange. Maybe that's Grand Flow. This one smells like a lobby, too. I can't I can't place it. Not this is the smell of Disney. Yeah, but there's specific hotels, like the Green Clover and Aloe is Beach Club. But I don't know what specific hotel I'm no, smelling. No, the whole thing is Aloe. 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 Okay. I'm on Amazon Every hotel. Oh, and this, you, you know what I'm talking about? Oh, so it's not just to the beach and yacht club? No, no. Oh. Just every, every hotel. I'm, I'm staying oh. in a French club. Okay. That's the Disney smell. Oh, okay. But they smell like different lobbies, though. Something. Oh, this smells good. I like. Is that vanilla sandal? Mm -hmm. Yes. What'd you get? No, it's too sweet. I don't know what that is. It's too sweet. I don't believe I got it. I don't believe in that. <laughs> is he saying that all the hotels smell the same? No. There's specific smells for each hotel. Mmm, that's good. That's good. <laughs> Was he saying that that's the one sent for all the hotels? Yeah, no. I think so. It's no, not. not the hotels it, don't all smell the same. No, they don't smell the same. Holly does not smell like Grand Clover and Al. You guys, you guys know that. The Polynesian smells very Polynesian. Like it's got a specific Polynesian smell. He said, I know. I'm here every day of my life. You're here every day of your life practically. You know those smells. <laughs> oh, look. It's possible. Hello? He was a young Walt. Oh, wow. Look. 28 and May. I was very, very young. Um, no. Oh, I. Yeah. No. <laughs> that's a location I know very well. So I'm like, no, that that's two locations I know extremely well. <laughs> Ooh. Oh yeah. good to know. I didn't know, is it for dogs and cats that oils are bad or is it just cats in general? Or pets in general, like they shouldn't be touching the oils, like dogs and cats or is it just cat specific? Because luckily I don't I don't have them. I know a lot of friends of mine use the diffusers and I was thinking about getting one. I just strictly do I just strictly do the, um, the oils, I mean the candles. Oh look, you got different tags for the different resorts. 
Yes. Thanks, Mel. I'm like, it's not the same, I swear. I know. Saratoga, you got Vero. Escape, uh, Hilton Head. Coronado, there you go. Port Orleans. You got Art of Animation. Aw. Staying there this weekend. Port Orleans Riverside. French Quarter. More art. Beach Club in the house. You got Yacht. Yeah, there you go. Yacht Club. Animal Kingdom. Nice. This one is my favorite store out of all the stores in here is Trendy because they've got a really good deal of really cool stuff for girls. <laughs> like backpacks and really cool shirts, spirit jerseys. I've just found really cool things in here. Your lounge fly backpacks. The most magical place on earth. That's cool. And they have my most favorite cologne perfume here. The Essence of Norway. Yeah. Or the Layla for one minute. That's what I put on. I love Layla. It's Essence of Norway. It's my favorite scent. Oh, so good. Layla is delicious. The frozen one is a little bit more watermelon based, but it smells good. They're too. both nice. I have them both. Yeah. <laughs> Layla I can wear all day it and it's, it lasts pretty good. Long time. That's why I waited. Love it. Rob, I'm over here. You can't see me because I'm a short person. Honey, I'm over here. <laughs> short person just melts into a crowd. Yeah. Chewbacca hat, ears, ears galore. Oh, did they get more? Oh, gotcha. That's okay. I mean, if that's what he smells, that's what he smells. You know, everybody's scents are different. Dumbo, Dumbo is cute with his feather. Yeah, I do love the Enchanted Tiki one. It's cute. Nothing new, but I've, I've gotten a couple of things from here. Just I like the fact that they sell the Layla and the Frozen perfume here. So if you don't have time to make it back to Epcot and you get, you're like, I really, really wanted that that perfume, then you can come here and get it. And that way you didn't even have to go to Epcot to go get it. <laughs> Yes, Layla, the essence of Norway. I know, I'm such a cheese ball because I always say it every time I walk by Norway. It's all good. Ooh, wild and free Bambi and Thumper. That's cute. The pen? Okay. Yeah, that's cute. You need some Disney workout clothes or run Disney wear? Come here. They got a lot of the uh, run D stuff. See, run Disney skirts, leggings, tops. Awesome. Stitch, Cheshire Cat. Got the Maleficent. That's awesome. And of course, Mickey. Oh, the Spirit jerseys. This we almost forgot. They got these cute new ones that are like Little Mermaid. So we got an aerial one. Rob likes Snow White's the best. He likes snows. Yeah, I, I know, Corey, I know. And we've got, yep, this one, which is the Snow White one. I think it's really pretty. And Cinderella, yep. Actually, this one isn't Cinderella. This one's it's just a blue one. one. No, there's a Cinderella one with a slipper. It's a light blue. It might be sold out. It might yeah, be sold out. There was a light blue one that's a Cinderella slipper. This is Aurora for sure because we did ask the first time we saw them. Oh, it's raining. 
How did that happen? Is it stopped raining? It looks like it did. I just want to make sure. Is it still drizzly? Hey. Oh, yeah, really. I mean, there's there's a cable. There's yeah, there's drops. All right. I'm covering you. I'm covering you guys. And I'm just make it across over here. Running for pins. Running. Running. Running to the pin trading post here. So right across, there's Trendy right there. Just so you kind of know, it's right next to Once Upon a Toy. And then there's like the DVC hut. And then Ghirardelli is right there. Just so you have an idea where the store is. It's all connected. Like this is all part of the co-op. So from Trendy on down that way, it's like kind of one big store. But in little pieces, you know. Here's a magic. Oh, no. Huh? That's awesome. Show <laughs> that is awesome. Yes. It's a uh, St. Patrick's Day. Mm -hmm. Just for mm -hmm. Sketches 50. Oh, uh, there's only 50 of that. Yes. But that's not good. That's. Wow. Framing is 65. Is it an additional 65? Probably. Probably in the case, but ask them, just ask them, Pin collecting is very, very addictive. But this is a great place to find pins and magic bands. Um, lanyards. Dangly pins. Do you want any of the They also have Vinyl Nation here if you collect Vinyl Nation. Pin traders. They've got a plethora of pins here. They usually have, yeah, this is a place to go. They get a pass holder set of pins. That is awesome. They have a Disney Rewards pen. If you have a Disney Chase Visa, you could buy that. There's a Snow White one, too. Pass holder limited release. Curious, how much is this pen set? That's going to be $49.95. I get a lot. Six, okay. And it's the same ones that are on Magic Kingdom. That's, that's awesome. That's great. You have resorts, you get DVC ones. And you have all your different ways to carry your pins safely without them falling out. <laughs> you can always get those locking pin backs as well. Yeah, we can mini right over here. You're right. Hey guys. This is going on. Well, that's what happens when it rains. We just shop. Because you got to go from a... Yeah, it's like supposed to rain tonight, tomorrow, so, you know, Florida weather gets turns on a dime. Oh, I love it. That king is. That is awesome. I like to look for the case right here. It has all the limited edition pins, because these are fun. These are really cute. Lattes. Wow, living seeds, CD's Alpha. Got some Star Wars pins. Here's some commemorative pins, you guys. Some uh, festival of the arts pens left. 
but if you do have a Disney Rewards Visa, they have the um, Bullseye and Woody pin. That would be perfect to wear for the opening of Toy Story Land. This is pretty cute because it's got the kitchen, Crack Pots of Kitchen Cabaret. So you guys remember that whole food rocks, veggie, veggie, fruit, fruit time at the land before it is, before it went away, before Soren was ever there. Yeah, that is the spring break pin this year, and then you have the St. Patty's Day Jessica Rabbit. It's been a hot minute since you've seen any Roger Rabbit or any... This, these, these cast members are super, super knowledgeable, too, about what they have, and because it's kind of a big pin store. This is the, one of the best places to find pins, honestly, more than, like, the parks or the resorts, because they... You never know if they, if they run out there, check here. Check, come to Disney Springs and look for it. I'm looking for Rob. I don't know where he went. Because he could fall into a, uh, a, a giant pin. <laughs> a plethora of pins later, you know what I mean? You never know. Where did he go? Where did he go? He got what he needed. As those are concerned. Did you find it? It's in the case. Oh, yeah, okay. Did you see all the commemorative ones over here? No, I'm good. It's not a. Ooh. Yeah, it's not a limited edition. Oh, that's cute. Did you see that they had Black Panther magic ones? Still? Mm. How much was this one? Online. Yep, I knew that. It's under, it was just online. I'm good with that though. Because it's a limited release, not a limited edition, Corey. I only get limited edition now just because I have so many already. So I just do limited release. The limited release comes in the blister packs. I don't know where he got this from. Right there. Thank you, thank you. Oh, it's the only one left. That's why. <laughs> thank you. Yay. Yep. Nice. Nice. Did you see these limited edition ones? Perfect. This one's $49.99 pass holder only. It's like the little bronze statues at Magic Kingdom. Mm -hmm. And then, I know you got that one, but did you see this one from last year? The Disney Visa one? No. Snow White and Dopey. They still have one left, so. 35th Epcot? Yep. Yeah. Pass holder limited release. Is there a, a Roger Rabbit set that you're taking? Just Jessica. Jessica. Do you have any Roger, aside from that other Jessica, is there, is there like, just, Roger? I think just Jessica. I know. It's like, he, he's like, do you know somebody that loves Roger Rabbit? Like, that's her favorite movie. And I'm like, gosh, I know. They only have it at Disneyland. They only have it at Disneyland. So I'm like, we don't have that here. I try. I try to look, but... Yeah, perfect. Well, we got we got our Jessica 2018 St. Patty's Day pin, so we're good. We're good. And oh, question. Yeah, of course. Um, I know the 20th anniversary Animal Kingdom Magic bands are going to be released on the 21st or the 27th. That's a question that I honestly don't know the answer to. Um, my best guess. Are you going to any parks? Um, we're local. So okay. I had the original blog said 26, and then it said the 21st. So um, no, I can like, answer questions about pins for you. Not so much, but not so much about so pins. So a little yeah, bit. Yeah, um, but those will be probably oh, just parts to, to the park. To the park. Okay. okay. Those, unless they don't sell them. And then they have green stuff. Okay, got it, got it. So definitely be at Magic Kingdom on the 20th. Between the 21st and the 20th. Animal Kingdom. Animal Kingdom, I believe. Yes, yes, yes. yes. Perfect. Because yeah. um, in the purple, I don't know if I you, but I know the purple will make it based on the other way. Yeah, I think so. Actually, I had a guest earlier, and I searched Eric's apps. I mean, I searched the app, and know it all. Oh, yeah, because I think it is only online. It's sold in the market. I don't know if it was sold out, but it, it came out online the 5th. But it's a limited release, so I don't buy a limited release. I only buy a limited edition. Yeah. They don't do anything unless they're in the box. Yeah. So not all of them even do stuff. You know, it just depends on the box. Have you so. checked out the Jenny and Burke and the Black Panther? I own both. <laughs> I, want I have a problem. They don't. They're they just don't. pretty. I like them. I, but I have a 
like the box more than I like the Because I'm like, $48, the most expensive magic band that you've ever buy. Black Panther is on entry only. Yeah, and it's purple, right? It's, I've heard lights of purple. What do you mean, the Black Panther one? Yeah. It's, it, it does, it has not ever done that for me, just purple. It works like oh, wow. it's great crowds. I have not maybe scanned it in a location where it works. I heard Epcot's the only one that a lot of their pillars work, so I've not yeah. tried my Black Panther. It's hurting when you go and it goes off, but they have the sound turned off. Yeah, like the lights will go on, like my Figment 35th, Magic Kingdom 45th anniversary bands. I know those light up special. Yeah. Like those are cool, the pink and purple, yeah. green, blue, and pink, like all of those, but then they don't make the sound. But Epcot yeah. has the most fast pass touch points that work. The one at Frozen has the sound. So unless you get a Frozen fast pass, you may never hear it. Yeah. Because, you know, they turn off the sound. But I've only ever heard, heard it purple. I've never okay. seen it light up. Um, was it a specific park that they used it? No, I heard, a just guest told me, came in to buy one and said that he had heard that it lit up. Oh, it makes sense, but I've not. I've used it quite a few times. I've only ever heard it around. That's about it. Thank you, though, for all yeah. your help, Elizabeth. Thank Appreciate you. it. Okay, thanks. Yeah, I knew it was online, but I thought maybe she would know something. I didn't know. You know, we gotta, we got to find out the scoop here. All these, all these limited edition things, they just fly like hotcakes. So I just want to make sure. Fish your friends, not food. Yes, Bruce. Oh, I know. Hank's been around for a long time, though. I love him. But Sassy Hank. I own his little baby plush. Princesses. Did you see the, the little limited edition plastic case where all the pens are? That one right there? No, no. There's another one. That's all. You got to go around here. I'm surprised you didn't find the, you gotta look at the case. That's the most important part. <laughs> Note to self, you gotta go to the case, guys. It's the hunt for merchandise is crazy. It's always, um. Oh, did I go all the way around the wrong way, sweetie? I did. Yep. It's a frenzy to buy magic bands. There's just a plethora of different ones, but I mean, most of those. Queen of Hearts one is cute, but you have the Jessica one there. Oops, sorry. They also have the, the Genie Spring Break one. Did you see that one? It's Spring Break 2018. That's a limited edition also. It's Genie. So I had some, some questions. I know one of you guys were asking me about the Spring Break pin as well, so... A limited release and regular bands come in a blister pack like that. The limited edition bands will only ever come in a box, like the Black Panther one, like that one. locking pin backs these are really good to get to so your so your pins don't fly off almost all of my pins have a locking pin back because you just tighten it with the allen wrench and that way they don't fly off into oblivion yep it's good it stopped raining so that's good okay, well, keep walking around try to find something to eat early sandwich is really good too they make you're like no it's right it's it's regular it's an oldie but goodie Oh, yep, the void, we've, we've streamed there before. Oh, it's still raining. we got to cut through the store again. We're just going to kind of keep cutting. <laughs> We're trapped in the rain. Great. It's a drizzly. Drizzly. Yeah, it's a sprinkling. 
more worried about you guys because we don't want to get the equipment wet. <laughs> you want to just get big bad wolves or you want to see if they're ready for us over there? Oh, okay. I don't know that they'll have slowed down at all. You can see. Oh, what did you, what else did you want to eat? If not there, you want to just do big bag rolls, or do you want to do something else? I'm trying to think what else is there. At homecoming? Yeah, we can do that. Yeah. Auntie Anne's? Ooh. Can I get a cinnamon? Oh, like I need more cinnamon pretzels in my life. Yeah, cinnamon pretzels are so good. The little bits, the cinnabits, those are good. We're gonna cut across. You can go through all the way through. Um, we're back into the co-op from Trinity. Everybody's making candle making. Get in, Mickey. <laughs> oh, it's all the way through now. photo taken because they can do the digital backgrounds and stuff I mean see they can superimpose you on Main Street right here with nobody there that's awesome and they do different backgrounds you can add uh, they can add animation like orange bird to the finger things like that it's really cool so inside the Rebus Brothers Tiggers are wonderful things. Yes. Because I thought they were made of springs. Wow, look at that. The tops are made of rubber and the bottoms are made of springs. Is that right? Wow. $37,000. You too can have this castle for $37,500. That is beautiful.
cut through the little tiny bit of World of Disney that's still open at the moment while we're uh, under refurbishment here. marketplace part of a Disney Springs so it's like I said it's like the mall section it's kind of got all the different shops further down Yes, the coach door is open, absolutely. Wednesday is my day off. Umbrella. Do they have an umbrella in here? I'm trying to keep you guys dry, that's why. <laughs> yep, I'm getting one. Hello, Hello. where did you have your umbrella? Uh, we don't have any in here. Oh, yeah, we used to. We used to, yeah. Um, we don't have any, though. We don't carry them for right now. Okay. We'll, we'll bring them back. I'm not sure. Okay. But this rainy season will be done. I can check. All right. No. Yeah. Oh, I'm going to check. Thank you. 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 Thank I have like about four of those Walt Disney World black umbrellas. I should, I should definitely do like a giveaway. <laughs> Get rid of all those umbrellas. I've used them once because I was stuck in the rain. But I have a bunch of little baby umbrellas that fit in my backpack. But of course, I did not bring it with me thinking that I wouldn't need it. But let's check out the Disney corner over here. Because I'm looking for the printed Disney umbrella anyway. This way we can keep walking around and we'll be just fine. This is the new corner store that they opened. It's awesome. Have you been in here yet, honey? That's what I get. I got you guys a little drizzly there. Ooh. Let's see if they have these umbrellas. Ears. <laughs> They're back. Back at the new spring. It's pretty much like girl stuff in here. Crazy amounts of girl stuff. Hey, umbrella. Hmm. Ears. Hats. No umbrellas? Really? The printed umbrellas, like the printed Mickey or Minnie umbrellas. The only umbrellas we have are the black, uh, regular the black, black ones. standard ones. Yep, yeah, yeah. Because I know I've seen the little printed ones some, sometimes too. Are you just staying with us for one night? Thank you. That one, thank you. Just the black one, okay. Well, you know I can add a fifth black one to my collection, <laughs> which I don't okay. use too terribly much. You need a Disney umbrella? Yeah. I'm working on trying to get a Disney umbrella. Uh, I, a fifth black one. I could get a black one. And you know what? I could just 
give it away to somebody because I have about four of those standard black Disney umbrellas. I'm just keeping you guys dry because we don't want to get you guys all wet. It's just a little drizzly. But this is that new Disney corner. They also have more girl stuff upstairs. But you can find ears, dresses, princess stuff. A lot of the women's attire apparel is in here. So we'll keep walking. Should I just go buy an umbrella? Yeah. No? But they're going to get wet and I want to get my equipment wet. This is the most important thing. Okay. Okay. Oh, super dry. Rob's favorite store. One of his favorite stores. But he's got to buy smaller sizes for everything now. <laughs> super dry is amazing. This is the marketplace section of uh, Disney Springs. It's slightly drizzling. I'm just covering you guys with my hands so that way you don't get too drenched. They have amazing quality. Like the shorts. Oh, honey, the shorts are back out. Your favorite shorts. Those are wonderful. Yes, those are them. They're not the cargoes you like? Are they new stuff? Oh, okay. I thought they were the ones he... Oh, the pockets are different. Yeah, the pockets are different. But they're very thick quality. You don't like those pockets, do you? No, I don't like the black. It has the similar... Yeah, they're a different style of last year. But... Oh, well. That's the only style they have in that cargo, isn't it? It smells really good in here too, but the other stuff is very, very well made. It's like very well made like Abercrombie or Hollister, but very well made. Like this stuff is thick and amazing. It's a company based out of the UK. I love their stuff. Like I have a few things that are super dry and I love it. I have a coat, sweatshirt, very, very nice. Very good stuff. Rob has about three pairs of those, but are too big for him, so he can't wear them anymore. The uh, struggle. We have a Kiehl's here. So if you need some good skincare in your life, some Disney balloons in the What's rain. This, uh, oh, this is cool. This is the one that looks Stance is the sock and underwear store. They sell women's underwear now too. Wow, that's new. Okay. They sell the Star Wars socks, basically. This is the marketplace. We have an anthropology here as well. A Lacoste. <laughs> I'm just kind of trying to stay under the awning a little bit. <laughs> so we have an anthropology. Oh, that was super dry. Yeah, yeah magical shopping. This is my most favorite store in the whole wide world. I'm not allowed to go in there when Rob's here because it'll be a two-hour event. It's my most favorite store in the whole wide world. Sephora. Yes. <laughs> in heaven, my idea of heaven, there's going to be a Sephora there. I can have whatever I want. <laughs> Zara. They wanted to walk into the coach store. Uh, the coach store used to be Vinnie Camuto's, but it's not Vinnie Camuto's anymore. Closed down. That's probably the only store that's closed down so far because it was a little too high end, maybe. But they put the coach store. I think it was probably a little too high end and not not popular enough. Yeah. I've seen some of Vinnie Camuto's stuff. I wasn't impressed. Right, right. But this actually part of the marketplace, this is where you go through to get to the bus loop. So if you want to go to the hotel buses, this is where you go through from the marketplace. So just keep going this way, make a right, you'll hit all the bus stops. So we have a giant Zara. And then guest services is straight ahead. There's only one entrance in, one entrance out. If you need a fuel rod, that's the other fuel rod location is the welcome center. And that's a full service guest services center. Oh, we passed by the coach store. So, so this used to be Vinny Camuto's, now it's coach. It's Disney coach though, so. You know I'm already gonna say that's expensive. <laughs> you know, it's different. And delicious in here. Thank you. 
Oh, I might have. Okay, that's the problem. I just might. Yep. Sometimes I do that. They had Disney backpacks. They sold them out. Up oh, they're right here. Those are awesome. But they're very expensive. Actually, I looked at this one. They have a whole Disney collection here. Limited edition, naturally. This is a beautiful color. Oh. Can you see how much that is? It's beautiful. That's expensive. I know it's just expensive. It's probably 300. I, I did check the price before. I think it's three something. Three Does it come with the pillow? Possibly. Mm. No price tag? Maybe in a little pocket. Weird. It's free. It's free. <laughs> no, you, how much are the little, the little and versus the big? I know they're two different ones. Too. The little ones can be three ninety five, and oh, the you? bigger one, I believe, is seven ninety five. Seven ninety five. That's a big one. Yeah, three ninety five for the little. I love the little. I love that color brown, like of camel. This is a beautiful camel color. I want to carve with that interior. <laughs> it is beautiful. And this one's actually 850. 850 for the big one. And then you have this custom one over here with all the stuff on it. It's really cool. I think that's the one that's 750. This is the one that's 750? And the camel. Oh, it's so pretty. Let me make sure. Yeah, the color. The color is just gorgeous. <laughs> the tags, they make it hard for you. They're make, always hidden in the they pocket. They're in the pocket, yep. Yeah. $5.95 for that one. Yeah, that's paying for that price, and it's ginormous. That's not bad at all. Definitely get a lot of use out of this. Oh, yeah. And it'll just weather nicely, probably, like, through time, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. So that one, I think that's your best bet, is to get that design and that color. And it has the patches, too, so that's beautiful. Thank you for checking for me. You're welcome. Appreciate it. $5.95 for this one. Mm -hmm. I guess because that one has hand stitching around it, so I like this style anyway. But, uh, in the right color, it's pretty, and it comes with a little Disney coach and scarf. Yeah, I'd be like, hey, this is cool. the scarf. That'd be my purse. That's honestly what I would wear. I use backpacks anyway, but I love like that color tan. They have the coach sneakers. It, we craft it. Nice. Oh yeah. So they were very ex expensive, as we said. Where did Rob go? We lost him again. Oh, he was looking at the guy's wallets. It smells good. I love the smell of wood. Oh, the Disney Coach purse is right here. Yeah, they have these handbags.
I just need to order one from Amazon, right? Affordable. Zara, I do love Victoria. I like actually the Zara perfumes. So if you go into a store that has nothing that has prices on it, that's expensive. <laughs> He's right. I love that. That's from the immortal Kathleen Light. She's my favorite beauty guru on YouTube. I, I She's from Miami. She reminds me of like girls I grew up with. That's why when she says that's expensive, I totally understand what she's saying. That's expensive. You know, but it's beautiful. I love it. That's expensive. Mm -hmm. Nice, Christine. I like, I love Michael Kors too, Danielle. I never discriminate with the designers. Louis Vuitton, I, girl, I like it all. I like it all. Yeah, I do love it. And then if, if you know, Sephora wasn't enough for you, well, I do need some setting powder, you know? Oh, I really needed to go in Sephora, but Rob won't go in there when I'm when he's here. He's like, no, get away from the Mac store. Get away, get away. <laughs> Zara is very affordable. Thank you. That is probably like the most inexpensive clothing store in all of Disney Springs is Zara. They have a men's section upstairs too. But that's like more, you know, it's kind of like Hollister for men. It's kind of like made for skinnier boys. Skinny, 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 skinny jeans, that kind of thing. So, but Zara's good. Kate Spade. Because we have Kate Spade Disney too, you guys. <laughs> we know, we've got it all. Her stuff is a little bit more expensive than the coach. John and was. We got a free people here, like in California. That's a very popular California store. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. Free your people and the rest will follow. Oh, they had the custom Uggs too, because you know it's so cold in Florida. Oh Lord, I like that dress. I, I, I know. I got sweaty feet. No, no coach. Put on the Uggs and you get sweaty feet. No, you don't. There Actually, you do. I love, they make custom Uggs here. They will bedazzle, bejewel your Uggs. But Disney Uggs start at like $495. They're even more expensive, expensive. than regular Uggs because they're bedazzled. And of course, we have to have a Lily Pulitzer store because it's reminding you of South East Palm Beach, honey. I do like me some Lily. I don't like for the summer. It reminds me so much of like Florida, Boca Raton. Let me go into Lily. It reminds me of like Palm Beach. I do like the little captain. It's like it's so pink in here. It's like reminding me of Boca, isn't it? It's so cute though. Like the whole coordinating outfit thing. I think just a little bit of splash. <laughs> These are cute. Ooh, these pink ones are nice. How'd you guys do in your competition? Uh, they're in second place right now. Okay. So, what was that? Uh, oh, well, I forgot. One team's second and one team's third. Okay. They're in third. Yeah. We're doing good. We're proud. Yeah. Who are you guys still around here? Yeah. Okay. Not too bad. Yeah. Little tennis skirts. I love resort wear. Resort work is cool. That's kind of a cute dress. I'll provide sun protection. 128. That's cute. Or maybe it's a little less bright. Not too bright, but I do love it for the summer when you have a really good tan and you're just looking cute. Baby elephants. Navy blue shirt, shorts, cute. Are you doing okay? Doing awesome. Did you find anything cute? Here? No, you're just playing on your phone. Yep. All right. Cute. I know. Rob's like it's not for him. This, yeah, this is a little bright, but it's resort wear. It's a very Boca Raton Palm Beach store. It's, it should be bringing you flashbacks. Oh, the Louis Vuitton store? Nice, girl. Nice. $1,000 a pop minimum on some shoes. You need your Sperry's. Got little boat shoes. 
I remember my first pair of cherry, this is, you know, back in the day, they were green. I had green top ciders when they first came out. Oh, the yeah. original boat shoes. They were like bright green, like the emerald green, that's the word. Oh, I do like this store, American Threads. They've got cute clothes in there. Cute, 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 cute clothes. Cute. I like the white dress. That's pretty. It's getting to be spring. We need some. Oh, look, umbrellas. <laughs> We're okay now, though. I can't get up. Ooh, shades. I have those shades. Hmm. Oh, Def Leopard. Wow, that's cool. Bringing you back. Very soft and comfortable. He is absolutely. And Uggs are designed to make your feet, um, they're not supposed to sweat. In the winter, they're supposed to keep them warm. In the summer, they're supposed to keep them cool. The sheepskin is designed that way. So you're not, it's not supposed to make your feet sweat. <laughs> Oh, you got a clear backpack. Any of you guys work in retail? I remember that back in the day. $38.99 when you needed a clear backpack. See in the mirror. <laughs> I mean, it's cute little pieces and they're like 20 bucks, 30 bucks. So it's a little bit more. Not overly crazy expensive. It's a string doll. It's just pretty and light because it's springy, springy clothes. Ready? Vera Bradley. A lot of Disney Vera Bradley stores. And then Sugar Boo, they had their booth. It, Sugar Boo is good. That's a cute little store. They had that little booth at Epcot at the Festival of the Arts. Um, they have just cute, like, houseware things, which are really, really nice. Everything but water. You see a lot of Vera Bradley um, stuff at the Character Warehouse at the Disney Outlet. You'll find a lot of Vera Bradley uh, backpacks and bags. So, and even some do need. So definitely check out the Character Warehouse when you come in. Just so you don't, uh, you know, just in case you can get a better deal there. This is the Sugar Boo and Company store. They have the coolest things in here. Oh, I kind of like those test tube flower holders. That's kind of cool. Put good things into the world. I agree. That is the only way to be. Oh, man walks into the door. It says out. Mom needs that. A little wine thing. It's cool. That is cool. It's a wine dispenser. That's cool. I think they'd enjoy that. More soaps. stores at Disney Springs. <laughs> you can go to the Columbia outlet at the Orlando Premium outlets, but this Columbia store is not an outlet store. But yes, Corey, you're right. <laughs> we have a Columbia. You never know, 
never know when you might need, you know, gear. I did go to the grand opening, so I did I, I did go to the grand opening of their store. Um, one of their managers. There we go. One of their managers invited me. That was like almost two years ago now, the grand opening of their store. They had um, Marimoto Asia cater their food and everything and it was really good and they were doing giveaways and like little scratch off games and I have an embroidered hot pink Columbia shirt with my name on it. I'll have to wear it one time because I won it from going to the grand opening. Oh, you went with me too, right baby? Remember for the Columbia grand opening? We went in there, yes. we had to scratch off like Rob you won. won the shirt. I won the shirt, you won a water bottle because we still have that neoprene like mm -hmm. water bottle. So we won a couple things there that was really cool. We got invited to go to the grand opening of that store. That was neat. Oh, there's just cute little, see if you have that whole kind of farmhouse vibe to your house, this is awesome. Just cute. Yeah, I kind of like that saying, I'll live for the moment, exactly. That's a great one too. Always be on the lookout for the presence of wonder. Absolutely, because honestly, it's just wonder, why are they sneaking up on me? <laughs> cool postcards. That's cool. Oh, these are leather. Leather um, notebooks or journals. That's nice. Oh, gathered tr truths. Bibbidi bobbidi boo. May all your wishes come true. But I love that. All the things to the world. There you go. Look famous, be legendary, appear complex, act easy, radiate presence, travel light, seem a dream, and prove real. Huh. Be prepared, the Boy Scout motto. I thought that was the song that Scar sung. Sorry. Uh, today is going to be the best day ever. Alright, let's go get some thigh high biscuits before I die of hunger. <laughs> Thank you. You're just trying to get some uh, time in. Let that dinner rush go through. It's almost nine, so that should be good. Hopefully they are slow down a bit, but now in my restaurant is not slow. I'm gonna need some biscuits in her life. <laughs> Is that raining hard up there? What do I see? We need to cut across if we're gonna go eat that way. The homecoming. Yeah, yeah, a yummy. I'm just trying to stay in the tarp. Either way, we can just go straight ahead and make a right. Go back around. Oh, what is Rob playing? Nothing. Why, why are you all up in my business? <laughs> no, it's Star Wars. Star Wars. Galaxy of Heroes. Galaxy of Heroes. Yeah. It's very addictive and they rip you off. Yes. Yeah, very addictive and they rip you off. <laughs> There's a the Coca Cola store. Coca Cola for dinner. <laughs> Hollywood cool looking, but the food is no bueno. Very expensive. Like, that's expensive and it's terrible. With, with three R's in it. Like, it is not good. No. And it's terrible. It's bad. Even though they had Guy Fieri redesign their menu, not really. It, it, it didn't come out good. The food is, it was not worth the money and it was not good. What's your favorite thing to Okay, if you can go anywhere else in the world, any place that doesn't say obviously you love it. You go to Australia, we'd like to make a Dying of hunger. A Coca Cola store is fun. You've got three levels of Coke products. Oh. I wish it's our boot up there because I would just have a, a football. Just your own personal football. That's perfect. Right. 
Chicken and dumplings. Oh yeah, chicken and dumpling soup is good. Are we cheating? Yes, we're cheating. We're gonna cheat hard. I want thigh high chicken biscuits. Okay, let's do it. And maybe some dumplings. And maybe some chicken and dumpling soup, and you can have them split in half into two bowls. So that's a good way to split this. A good server. Why would I do that? <laughs> Rob's not sharing. Yeah. I went to his restaurant in Vegas too, Victoria. I was there for the grand opening of his burger joint in Vegas, and that was meh, okay. Meh. He, I mean, he's not like a master chef. He's not a Gordon Ramsay. He won the Food Network star. Guy theory. Oh yeah, he's like a, he is a Michelin star chef. Are you kidding me? That man is a god. <laughs> No, but Gordon Ramsay is. He studied under Guy Savoy, who is one of the French masters. Is that English? No, he's oh. French. <laughs> the best chefs are French. So, yeah. Oh, I know my Gordon Ramsay. Mm hmm. <laughs> Pet store. Gordon That's right. Oh, I, I just, he's, his restaurants are amazing in, in Vegas. They have a Hell's Kitchen in Vegas now, too, which is awesome. One of my good friends is working there. I'm so jealous. I'm like, girl. Yes. Because usually I'll get cut by 9.30, so it's almost done. It's the time I get cut. So I'm like, all right. Here, but it's all you can eat. Toppings, like put as much toppings on there as you want. It's like a Chipotle, but for pizza. See, much better. Because it rains. I can't sit at the bar, unfortunately. 